Hello there, my name is Bryson Jack. I just wanted to share a quick tip on how to name your objects, your object and mesh data, and um, just keep keeping your scene clean. And this is something that I do habitually. I haven't ever found a, a good way to do this with any kind of an add-on, and um, unfortunately Blender doesn't do it natively. But So if I have a cube here, let's say this was actually not a cube, this was my house, or let's just say a car, so I can name that. And then what I also want to do is I want to come over here so right here I'm in the object panel I want to come over here to the data panel and then I've also got my object data here and you can just see it's named cube01 so no matter what this object was if it was really complex or whatever it would just have it would retain its basic object data name of cube or you know cylinder or whatever and so I want to make sure that I uh, keep my objects and my object data name the same and it just it just helps in this list when you're uh, if you're ever like using you know making link duplicates or whatever you can find your stuff easily and it's just nice to just keep your scenes clean and so there's not garbage data anyway so what I was doing before was I would I would click in here and I would select and then I would hit control C to copy and then I would come over here and then I would click in here again and I would hit control V and then enter and so that's uh, as far as economy of motion, that's a lot of steps. Um, and so, later on, I figured that figured out that when you highlight or when you excuse me, when you hover over this area, it you can see that it starts to highlight, and it's a really faint highlight, so you might be missing it. And I looked inside of the themes, and I don't see any way that I can actually make this highlight appear stronger. It doesn't appear to be possible in Blender. But anyway, if you if you hover over and you can you get it to highlight, then you don't have to actually click in it. You can just hit Control C to, to copy it. So I'll just change this to house here and show you. So so I, if I hover and then I hit Control C and then I come over here and I hover over this and I hit Control V, then it'll also change it. All right. Um, but there's actually an even easier way, and that's why I'm showing this. Um, and so if I come over back over here. And I'll just uh, call this a box. All right. Uh, if I just name it that, and then I come over here, then to my data panel, then I can just come to this uh, icon right here that says box, and I can just drag it into this field, and it will just paste it. All right. So that's the tip. Um, if you want to just, you can name your item here, then you just come over here to the data panel, and you can just drag this, and it's done. So hopefully that helps you and uh, have a great day.